Hey guys, we are upstairs and I have got all of my wrapping stuff out. This is officially the Christmas wrapping station. I have just a little bit of everything. I pulled everything out. It all goes in that room right there and after I'm done wrapping some presents, I'm gonna go through these buckets and clear stuff out. Look at her. Little Miss Curiosity. <laughs> yeah. Um, Mo Lola loved, loved to play in these boxes, like closed boxes. She loved to play in them and she would then she would just lay in the box and I couldn't use them until she got out because I was too nice and I wouldn't make her get out of the box. <laughs> I sure miss her. She was so fun at Christmas. And already little Miss Princess is bored and wants to look out the window and look at the neighbors. A bunch of gifts here covered up. I'm going to wrap them but I can't show you what they are. These are my niece's gifts and her... They and her mom, they and their mom sometimes watch my channel and I just don't want them to see what I got them because <laughs> that would just ruin it for everybody. And I, you know, I just don't want them to be disappointed or bummed out or whatever. I just don't want to, of course you don't want them to know what they're getting for Christmas. So, um, I'm going to show, <clears throat> I'm going to video me wrapping but I will have already started each pre each present so you won't be able to see what it is When I was upstairs wrapping presents, a present came for me and my husband. This is from Kay Carter. She's such a sweetheart. She sends us something every year. And this is from Harry and David. And I don't know what it is, but let's have a look. Ooh, a tree. Whoa, what is this? This looks like baklava. Holy mackerel. Two of them, and they are heavy. Holy cow. These look delicious. I do think they're baklava. Let's see, does it say on the back? Um, not that I see. Oh, yep, baklava right at the top, duh. Baklava, thank you, Kay. I love baklava. My friend Kathy is Greek, and 
her mom used to make homemade baklava all the time and sometimes they'd give me some and it was just such a treat and it was so sweet of her to always do that and this is just amazing. Thanks, Kay. This looks so delicious. I appreciate you and I love you and tell Ron hello and I just love ya. Not so easy with one hand and tennis shoes. sitting up there wrapping presents going out of my mind because of all the mess and confusion and I was looking for certain bags and I couldn't find them and I was getting really restless and so I'm like I gotta go to five below or something I, I don't know but I gotta get out of the house and go somewhere fun so that's what we're doing I don't know if it's going to be fun, but we're going to go somewhere. We're headed to the Target. Well, Target is proving to be no fun. Everything's so expensive here. None of the clothes are on a good sale at all. This is like a flashback to the empty Dollar Tree the other day. starts to add up you know and so I just I didn't get anything and they didn't have much in in the way of under five dollars so and Target was awful you saw that it's always empty especially the Target Playland or dollar spot whatever you want to call it it's always empty like that it never fails it's always empty like that summer Spring, winter, fall. Empty, 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 empty. So I'm on my way to the grocery store again because I need to get caramel sauce for the Better Than Schmageggy cake. I forgot to get that yesterday. And um, I need to pick up a prescription. So that's what's going on at this moment. I'm in five o'clock traffic and it's gonna be a while. So we're fending for dinner. I'm going to have a little bit of cheese and crackers. This comes with smoked turkey. And it's this, I picked this up the other day. And it's got some cheese. And these are really good crackers. So I'm just gonna have some of this for dinner and maybe some chips.
well, I did a mile, I think. Let me see. Yep, just barely did a mile. My toe, my big toe, hurts so bad. And every so often it hurts this like this. And I can't even walk on it. So I'm going to switch over to the horse. It's like a, re a recumbent bike. And it's also a... Uh, um, whatever the an elliptical so I'm gonna do the elliptical there's no batteries in it right now so I can't adjust the settings to make it harder but it's hard on its own without the battery settings it gets really tough so I'm gonna go ahead and set my iPad up there and finish watching some videos and hopefully I can ride this thing for a while.